This is our patient, Charles. Charles, tell us a little bit about yourself and what brought you here. Uh, I'm an architect and I practice and I'm with my wife, who's also an architect. We've been in business for 40 years. There's a lot of drawings to be looked at and the older I got, the worse it came to be able to see them, especially with print, being able to print, it's, you can get small format. So I gradually went from uh, uh, light sight glasses uh, to really strong and then uh, something else occurred at the same time. I do a lot of trail running okay. and I was having problems uh, real recognizing a rock from a root from a, a, a leaf and I was falling a lot and it became apparent that if I was going to continue running, especially trails, yeah. and, and not killing myself doing it, I was going to need to have some way of improving my, gla my vision. Glasses were not an option, okay. and so I turned to um, Dr. Furlan. Now, and how has it changed your life? And what do you foresee doing in the future as a result? Well, now I can run trails without having to be so careful about every step I take. Or looking at drawings is like 100%. Getting rid of my glasses was a major thing. Now I can run trails, of course. I, yeah. can, I can read better. I can read books without my glasses, without glasses and I don't have to carry them around and feel like, where are they? So you got a Who's lot out of it. I got a lot. Come in for somebody that has some similar problems, has this problem with up close and distance for different reasons. What would you recommend? Oh, I'd recommend getting surgery. Okay. As, as, as soon as you realize that it's gonna be a benefit to you, I, that's what I do. Affecting you on a day-to-day -day basis, it's one of the most powerful things that I've ever done. Of course, winning the Boston Marathon would really be bought. Well, would that be would great be, too, yes. But everything is dependent on your eyes, and, um, and so I wish I had just done it earlier.